What's going on guys in this reaction, Brand of Sacrifice back on the channel. The song is Lifeblood featuring Will Ramos this time. Will Ramos is the lead singer now of Lorna Shore. He is ridiculous. Kyle is ridiculous. This song is going to be ridiculous. I reacted to this song when it came out as a single before the album came out. This song's a banger. I know this is just going to take it to another level. If you're new, make sure you subscribe. Let's go. Oh, this is gonna be ridiculous. The song was already ridiculous. Like, Brand of Sacrifice, they don't need Will Ramos to be on this song. Kyle does everything in this song amazingly. You know, Kyle has the highs, the lows, the piggy, the goblin. Like, he has it all. Will does too. Just the idea in my head of, like, them being together on this track just makes it that much more ridiculous. I didn't even think about like layers in this song with them. I just thought kind of like a back and forth. There's gonna be a lot of layers. Will. <laughs> Like, I wonder what, you know, the phone call or the DMs were like for this. You know, it's like, you know, I think you should do this part. I should do this part. Oh, no. Nah. Let's just do some of them together. <laughs> this joke is ridiculous. Got the snort going. Those pig squills, man. The pig squills were absurd, like on this album for Brand of Sacrifice, but like, you know, Kyle's parts. But you add Will in there too for like layers or whatever he wants to do good grief this is
this is how I expected it to go. Like, you know, I knew Will would do a lot of like the high parts and a lot of the like goblin sound. I just did not think about the layers. When they did those parts together, off the chain. This song is so good. And having Will Ramos on here just added another element. Lifeblood, brand of sacrifice, Kyle, Will, killed it. It's still an even more a banger. Let me know what you thought about it in the comments. If you're new, make sure you subscribe.